Shakira, aka Shakira Isabel Mebarak Rapol, a renowned Colombian pop star, and Gerard Piquet, a Barcelona centre back defender, announced their split on Saturday, June 4, after more than a decade of marriage. The couple's split comes after rumours of Piquet's infidelity surfaced. Such allegations, on the other hand, came from untrustworthy sources that have since been mostly debunked. The ex-couple issued a joint statement to the media, which stated, we regret confirming that we're splitting up. For the welfare of our children, which is our top priority, we ask for respect for our privacy. Thank you for understanding, Shakira and Piquet are parents to two sons, Sasha Piquet Mebarak, born 2015, and Milan Piquet Mebarak, born 2013. The former pair have been together since 2011, after meeting during 2010's FIFA World Cup, which took place in South Africa. Earlier in 2017, rumors about the 45-year-old singer-split songwriters from the 35-year-old Spanish footballer made the rounds in the media. However, nothing came of the rumors at the time, as their split was never officially confirmed. Meanwhile, many fans believe that the singer had recently referenced her separation from Piquet in a song during the recent development of their split. The hips don't lie singer used the following lines in the song T Felicito Feet Rao Alejandro, to complete you I broke into pieces, I was warned, but I didn't listen, I realized that yours is false, it was the drop that overflowed the glass. Don't tell me you're sorry, that sounds sincere, but I know you well and I know you're lying. There's also talk that the Colombian singer sparked the breakup because of Gerard Piquet's alleged affair. The claims of Piquet's alleged infidelity with fellow Spanish footballer Pablo Gavi's mother were false, according to sports journalist and FC Barcelona player Res Hadraman. These accusations came from a satirical account. As of now, there have been no credible reports to back up such claims. Meli Isat AIL, an international freelance journalist, first broke the parody news. The report, however, has since been removed. Shakira and Piquet's split was announced just days after the singer filed an appeal in a Spanish court to avoid a tax fraud trial. The Barranquilla, Colombia native allegedly failed to pay 14.5 million euros, 15.54 million dollars, in tax on income earned between 2012 and 2014. According to Spanish prosecutors' claims, meanwhile, the singer's representatives claimed that she was living in Catalonia at the time and had only returned to Spain in 2015. Following her return, however, the pop star stated that she has always paid her income taxes. Last week, her lawyers told Reuters, Shakira's conduct on tax matters has always been impeccable in all the countries she had to pay taxes in. So yet, there has been no indication that this legal problem was a factor in their split. All claims about the reason for their split are still unsubstantiated as of now. The allegations were true, as it was revealed on Saturday that Colombian singer Shakira and Barcelona footballer Gerard Piquet had ended their 12-year partnership, leaving them with a shared inheritance of about 700 million euros, in addition to two children in common. Shakira and Piquet have already begun the formal divorce proceedings. Both have recruited specialized lawyers to begin the procedures, according to the media. Some procedures that, according to experts, should not pose major problems since the couple never married, so their individual fortunes might be in the clear, for it is most likely that personal fortunes will remain independent. Some millionaire fortunes, fruit of the success in their professional careers, considered one of the most successful artists of recent times, Shakira, according to Celebrity Net Worth, has more than 125 million records sold worldwide and has a fortune of $300 million. Furthermore, prior to beginning her relationship with the soccer player, the Barranquilla woman owned several properties, including a 1.1 million euro home in the Bahamas and a luxurious 8,400 square meter mansion in Miami which she tried unsuccessfully to sell a few years ago for nearly $14 million. Piquet also possesses a sizable fortune, estimated to be around 75 million euros. As a result of his great soccer career and commercial ventures, 
Gerard Piquet has been able to invest his money quite well, in addition to the over 5 million euros he makes per season at FC Barcelona, as he has revealed. In 2017, he founded and shares Cosmos Holding, a company with which he has completed a wide range of projects, including the purchase of two football clubs, FC Andorra and Gymnastic Manresa, the management of the Davis Cup, and the celebration of the Soccer Super Cup in Arabia, which is why it has been splashed in a commission payment case. In addition, the athlete has co-founded a number of successful enterprises, including an isotonic drink and an esports team with Ibai Lanos. The footballer owns a residence in Barcelona's city centre. According to a Spanish daily, it's a three-storey property on Montana Street that was worth 4.5 million euros a decade ago. Piquet remodeled a magnificent residence. The accounts that are at stake, Shakira and Piquet have a shared real estate history in Spain, despite their virtually different economies. The couple acquired a property with 3,800 square meters in the Elitis Flugs de Lobrega neighborhood in 2012, which they restored and equipped with all the amenities. The facility includes a gym, a pool, a movie theater, a tennis court, and a recording studio where the singer has worked in the past, although the property's current valuation is uncertain. It was reported in 2012 that they spent around 4.5 million euros for it. Three years later, in 2015, the singer and player purchased a new home in the Pedralbes district, which is relatively near to the Camp Nou. They spent 5 million euros for this exquisite home in the area where the Infanta Cristina and Iarchi Erdangarin used to dwell. The mansion has a total area of 1,300 square meters, four levels, and unrivaled city views. His fortune's accounts must likewise go through the financial scandal that has engulfed them both. According to a court judgment, there is enough evidence to think Shakira stopped paying the Spanish Treasury 14.5 million euros. The judge ruled that she was already a resident of the country between 2012 and 2014, despite her claims that she was in the Bahamas and only visited the Iberian Peninsula on occasion. Shakira, for her part, has stated that she has no outstanding obligations with the Treasury because she has paid everything that they have demanded up to this point. Piquet, for his part, is also in trouble with the law. The anti-corruption prosecutor's office announced on May 19 that it opened an investigation against him and Luis Rubiales, president of the Royal Spanish Football Federation, to determine if there was any crime in the contract to play the Spanish Super Cup in Saudi Arabia. Thank you for watching till the end. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel to see more interesting videos.